Okay, so we're going to go over doing a... Um, all right, so I'm going to go over doing a, a basic everyday note. So from this screen, our start screen, we're going to go in and select a patient. So let's select Martha here. And we'll say that today, um, subjectively, or well, you can see her complaint that we've entered right here. She has shoulder problems, so we'll pick that. We can scroll through and pick the complaint that most closely matches what we want to say about her. I recommend that you uh, break this down. I've put a lot in here. You might want to look at the section on editing and take some of these out. Uh, I like to only have five or six in my uh, one that's slightly better, uh, moderately better, quite a bit better, uh, and, and a lot better. And then it's much faster to pick the one that I want to use. But you can put as many as you like in here. So let's say that today we'll choose that uh, treatment today is for her complaint, that right shoulder and neck problem. We'll click done. Um, if there's anything else we'd like to add, um, like for example that the patient's doing better today, so we'll click better. And well, let's say that uh, since the last visit she's saying that uh, it's it's a bit better. And again, in that section, pick whichever that, that, that you like and edit them to fit your practice. Now we'll go down to objective and we'll say that uh, the patient's better. Again, we're going to be able to pick the one that we want to use, and we'll say that uh, that's the one we're going to use today. Maybe I want to add a test on top of that. I may want to use a template that I've created, so uh, we could use certainly use one of those, or we could come back in and say that um, we're going to go ahead and do an exam. So let's say that we want to just mention some things about uh, posture today. The posture that we checked today revealed that the head was anterior, the right hip was low, and the left shoulder was low. And then we'll come back in and if we'd like to add some details about uh, as far as drawing, we could say that we palpated some adhesions here and maybe the patient had pain here and here and we noted that there was uh, some spasm present in this region. So we just touch the screen and enter uh, what as we move down here and select the underlined one by just clicking on it, then we can go over and touch wherever it is if there's a tender point perhaps there and there then this will be saved so when we're finished and we'll go back to our note and go to assessment and if the patient's better same or worse we'll say that the patient's a little better again we can pick the statement that best describes them being better and then plan if we've already treated the patient or have entered information we can hit same as previous and it will put in what we've already done if not, we may want to pick, go into our therapy and we'll say that modalities, we did some electrical stim on the neck and right shoulder and we did some trigger point work on the shoulder, mid back and neck and we also did uh, an adjustment with a diversified adjustment to the neck and shoulder and we did an extremity adjustment here and to the elbow and also Perhaps we want to say that uh, we're going to have the patient continue with their exercises for the neck, the mid-back, and the right shoulder. Now when we open our note, we can quickly go over and make sure that everything that uh, we did is, is on the note and outlined in the note. We can also uh, open up the man, make sure that the drawing reflects what we want to say. Now that's what's going to be saved, so we'll save this note for the day. And yes, our note is saved. And we're finished.